In Cosmos, the concept of world in this season three goes beyond, is there another planet we might live on? All of that's explored in the animations, the visualizations, the on location. But we take the concept of world another notch higher. And action. It's hard to believe. Arrow, Boulder. We can't take cameras into outer space. We can't take cameras into the past, the future. Everything had to be invented. Come with me. It's a great sequence that was one of the hardest to do was the origin of life, the first organic molecules mm. that form at the bottom of the sea in a hydrothermal vent, which is a pretty ambitious thing to try to depict. The ship of the imagination dives into the primordial ocean and we get to see how life may have started. And it's a sequence that starts in normal scale, but we end up at the atomic scale provided piles of challenges and we managed to solve them all and it's visually stunning. And it took a long time to get to a point where it was scientifically plausible and inspiring to watch the formation of the first organic molecule. It's the beginning of everything. The place where the series lands is a vision of the future as imagined in a World's Fair in the year 2039. Those who have ever been to a World's Fair may have memories of them imagining a future that is hopeful and peaceful. Such was the World's Fair of New York in 1939. And so I was really excited by the grandeur of this vision of a new colossus in New York Harbor, a trip to the six pavilions of the 2039 World's Fair. Thanks to the genius of VFX supervisor, Jeff Oaken. That was thrilling, I'm super proud of it. The sum of all the hope that has been expressed in all the episodes is manifested in what civilization could be. Science is magic, but it's real magic. That's 24 trillion miles to Proxima Centauri. The opportunity of Cosmos is to introduce people to the science we live with every day and show you how amazing it is in such a compelling and immersive way. The possible world that excites me the most is the one we can have here on this one.